Here at Ray Hall Letterman Lanigan Racing, our goal is to put the best drivers in the best cars to win championship and races. of the Indianapolis 500. So we've been under a few different names here, but uh, the goal has always been the same, to be the best race team out there we can be, best race team out there, period. And uh, paid off with the chance, you know, winning the 500 last year. The IndyCar team is based out of Indianapolis. Uh, we have, depending on the year, around a 17 race schedule. During that time, we have roughly two days a week to turn the car over from race to race. Cars will be unloaded from the trucks. The cars will then be completely disassembled. Every part will be looked over, crack checked, before being reassembled and shipped back out the door for the next race. In IndyCar, we reach speeds of around 240 miles an hour. Every little detail matters. Um, if you make any mistakes whatsoever, that's the difference between a win and a loss. In the IndyCar series, everyone uses the same Dallara chassis. Making it faster than the other guys comes to the smallest of details. You can't just do it with a set of micrometers and a tape measure anymore. And most of the stuff you can't even see anymore. You have to find a way to look at it and the 3D scanning helps you. It pulls it all out for you. And we need every tenth of a mile an hour, every hundredth of a mile an hour. And to do that, we have to examine the smallest of details. As the years go by with the same car particularly, you have to find ways to make them better and better and better. We had to find a new way, a new technology to make the car more precise and cleaner. The cars are so finely tuned now, we need a really defined instrument. And 3D scanning is the next solution for us. The way we use 3D scanning is to compare or correlate the data that we get from the wind tunnel. When we bring multiple cars uh, with multiple underwings, we're able to see the little differences in how the molds affect uh, the overall performance of the car. So we then use that wind tunnel data and compare it with the 3D scans we've done to then find those small areas that would be different and then figure out what the performance gain or loss is due to those differences. We use the Zeiss 3D scanner to scan the underwing, the bodywork, the wings, pretty much every aspect of the car to maximize the downforce and minimize the drag. It's the smallest of details now between having a really good car and one that's just a tenth of an hour slower and the 3D Zeiss scanners help us with that. It's been a really quite a godsend for us because we could see things that we never would have saw by, with our naked eye or with the measuring tools we had. It's a measuring tool beyond compare. We're gonna put these cars back together, examine all the details, check all the measurements, get them back in the trucks, back on the track, and we hope to see you there.